Hey everyone, Barry Johnson of Easy Computer Solutions. Today we have the acoustic foam panels from AeroZoom. Let's go. All right, so first things first, take care that you don't cut through the package too quickly. You want to try to cut through one layer at a time so as to not disturb the acoustic foam panel. So make sure you take care and check where you are. So now that we've done that, let's verify that we have all the panels here. You're going to have to go through what is called the restoration process, waiting with your acoustic foam panels for 24 hours to let that air that was taken away during storage and shipping to let it restore the foam to its original size. When the foam is not restored, this is what's gonna happen. If we look at these two acoustic foam panels, you'll see that there's a difference. One has been restored to its original height and the other one hasn't. And AeroZoom is ready for this scenario. What can happen is we need a little boost to get air back into the foam panel. So all you have to do is add water if you have a case like this, and then wait another 24 hours. So the maximum you should have to wait is 48 hours. Now props to AeroZoom. There are other companies out there that I have seen get complaints because no matter how long people try to restore, they have an issue. AeroZoom stands by their product. So if you have any issues, you can just contact them. I actually did all of the black side because if you look in back of me, on the black walls, I actually have blue. So I'm going to install the blue panels on the side, on the opposite side to the left of me, which you saw at the very beginning. And then I'll show is where the black ones are going to be. So what I try to do is make sure that I try to take care of the first reflection. If I point out in front of me, what's going to happen is sound is going to project this way. It's going to bounce off. And the first reflection is going to come back over to here. That's why these panels are here and the other panels will be put on the opposite wall. And I can tell you already, just by adding that, I have knocked down my sound tremendously. The biggest culprit now with these panels installed is the fan on my PC, which is gonna be remedied soon. But I have to say that I am extremely impressed with these panels going off the pricing and then knowing that they're eco-friendly, they're non-toxic, they're easy to move and remove like if you need expansion. So it's really a win-win when you think about what AeroZoom has brought with the price point. Now that we've restored, and I talked about the res restoration process, let's go ahead and talk about what we can do to install. This is probably the easiest install that you're probably gonna do in your house. What you do is just simply put either command strips or the included double-sided tape onto four corners of each panel, and then simply put them on the wall in the right placement. So as you do put them on the wall, you just wanna smooth out at the top and the bottom and just keep applying. So here is the finished product for my first installation. And like I said, I couldn't be happier with how this turned out because let's be real, a lot of times when we think of doing this type of stuff, but you really start to look at some of the acoustic companies that are out there, it is very pricey. And this company has really brought the cost down. So with that said, I have to say I have been impressed and I'm just so glad that I'm going to be able to take my audio to the next level. And if you need to, whether you're doing a home studio, whether you're doing YouTube videos, whether you're doing just home theater, you can always improve that response and make sure your point source is getting going directly to your ears and knocking down the reflection reverb by simply adding a product from Aerosol. They have tons of products available. So check out their website. I think you'll be happy. And with that, bees.